Yo, what is good everybody? Welcome back to another Call of Duty mobile video. In today's episode, we're gonna give you guys some tips and tricks on how to level up your battle pass super fast. So, I was actually able to get up to 20,000 points at once. So that's kind of crazy. So I'm gonna show you guys a clip of that or I'll just show you guys a screenshot of it. 20,000, I got 20,000 points. I got 19. It's kind of insane. It was on domination. Uh, so what we're gonna be doing is talking about basically how it works, which game modes you should avoid, and then my top three game modes you guys should be trying out for it. So make sure to watch all the way till the end of the video because I'm actually gonna show you guys footage of me getting a double nuke uh, in one of the game modes and get a crazy amount of points. So basically there's two factors that's very important when it comes to getting the points you need for the battle pass. So first of all, it's the amount of time played. So obviously if you only play like five minutes or even two minutes in a game, you're gonna get a lot, a lot less points. And then the amount of kills you get slash the amount of points. So depending on the game mode you're doing based on how many kills you get or based on how many points you get. Now, to talk about basically what game mode you should try to avoid. Obviously SND is gonna be the main one you wanna avoid and TDM. Hard point, I wanna say it's gonna be like iffy if you wanna kinda do it, but then again, I don't think it's worth it just because most of the time, your teammate or you will be able to get the most kills on the other ones and it usually ends pretty fast. So those are three game modes I don't recommend you be doing. Now I'm gonna name you guys the top three that I will be doing. And also I'm probably gonna be dropping the fastest way to get the BR skin that just came out. I forgot what it's called. If you guys wanna see that, let me know in the comments down below. But for this specific video, I wanna to talk to you guys about three best methods or three best game mode you guys can play so first of all i'm gonna start with battle royale a lot of people have been talking to me about it on stream being like yo hitman br is the best way and from my testing on stream i did test a lot the other day or if it was today on stream for the points br is great it gives you 15,000 points if you win the game approximately that also includes the 25 percent bonus you get from getting the premium battle pass but if you're not doing a premium battle pass, you can get about 12,000 points, which is great. However, the downside is you're playing about 20 minutes, 18 minutes, 20 minutes, depending on how fast you can end the game. And although it is 18,000, not 18, 15,000 points is good. It's not great per minute, right? So it's, it's good if you're trying to grind your battle royale. So if you're trying to still get the rune skin, good way to grind. I was doing that on my free to play account. I was grinding at the same time. So I was able to do the rune skin and able to grind my battle pass. But the next two are gonna be a lot more efficient. So the next one I wanna talk about is domination. I'm sure a lot of you guys are probably think domination is not the best game mode to do it. I'll explain to you guys why in a second. So domination is really good, especially, actually not especially, you have to have teammates for this one and you have to all be on the same page because if you have teammates that triple cap you're not going to be able to get the full amount of points you want to get teammates that only cap your points so for example if you're on a side you cap a if you're on c side cap c don't cap b don't let your opponent cap your cap you also have to have someone on the point you know in the beginning so that you actually get the points now what you want to do is try to get the most kills you can. I think I managed to get a nuke. And I think the game that I got 20,000 points was on domination. I did get like 60 kills, 65 kills. I capped a bunch. I used a UAV. I used all my operator skills and, and so on and so forth. I, I did manage to also use, when it comes to uh, operator skills, I did use UAV, Shock RC, and I think I used Molotov or I used the counter UAV, depending on what I felt like doing. But... By playing this, you'll be able to play about 10 minutes of worth of gameplay, maybe eight minutes, eight to 10 minutes worth of gameplay, just because it should take you approximately five minutes per half, if not 4.5 minutes per half. So it comes up to nine minutes or 10 minutes, depending on how fast or slow it takes. But you can get a lot of kills from that. You can get, I think I got up to like 6,000 in-game points, not battle XP, but in-game points, which is pretty insane. Um, I did test whether it was better to just win the game fast. And yeah, I did domination triple cap ended in like four or five minutes. Not really worth it, but this way it's good if you're trying to just have fun, pub stop. Obviously this is all for pubs. This doesn't work for rank because rank and pubs all have the same amount of points that you would get. But again, this is all for pubs. So if you're just trying to have fun with your friends, pub stop, try to drop a nuke. And I'll probably drop a, a class that you guys can use for nukes. That would be very fun for you guys. But like I said, definitely just to have fun, drop your nukes, play on whatever map, on Rust, whatever, just try to get high kills, get a lot of XP. Like I said, 20,000 points. On average, you can get 12,000 points 
and that's including the battle pass bonus so 9,000 if you don't have the battle pass bonus even more and it's taking you about 10 minutes so for the 10 minute basis you get 12,000 points. And you're probably thinking, hey man, that's a lot of points for 10 minutes. How could anything beat that? Well, the number one game what you should be playing is Capture the Flag, and you should be playing this solo. So if you're playing this alone, and you're at, like on your bed, you're chilling, you're just, just at home, you're not playing with your friend, you're just trying to you know, have a good night playing alone, you play Capture the Flag. But there's a little trick. You need to play Capture the Flag, and you need to get the gold right away, and you need to try to kill as much as you can with the gold. You're not trying to win the game. You're trying to spend as much time as you can getting kills, dropping nukes, using your, your, your score streaks. Like So in my situation, I'll show you guys the gameplay of it at the end. I went on a capture the flag on, I believe it was Crossfire. I dropped a double nuke. Might not have even been on Crossfire. Don't exactly remember what it was, but I was rotating. Literally, what the holding the coin will give you is an extra 50 points per kill. You know how insane that is? 50 points per kill is insane so you can get kill plus 50 so 150 so you can get the uav not the uav the rc car the u yeah rc car uav and if you have the um, molotov like i did three kills gives you that which is absolutely insane yes your opponent knows where you are but it doesn't really matter because you're just trying to get as much kills as you want you can also cap your base you don't even have to return it but please remember that you do have to at least have a few points for the win so try to cap a few times try to kill the opponent's one from capping it but you guys will see, I got 15,000 points. So probably around 12,000 if you're not using the bonus for eight minutes of gameplay. So as you guys can see, this is probably the best game mode you can grind to get your XP leveled up. And it's so much faster than the other ones. I've been grinding this out and it's actually really fun and you can slay. And you know what? A lot of times you'll get a lot of bot lobbies, which if you're just trying to rank this up, perfectly fine but if you get good people lobby it's still fun because you're just fighting you're killing doesn't matter if you die but if you can get a nuke it is good so i'm going to show you guys the footage of me probably dropping a double nuke hopefully you guys will enjoy it again i think it's mostly against bots but i'll show you guys how many points you can get from that and hopefully in this video i'll show you guys as we talk through the video you'll get some clips of me actually dropping those nukes or just clips of me getting those points but that's gonna be it and hopefully you guys enjoyed and um, make sure to stay watch till the end so that we can, uh, you know, get some fun times together. All right, I'll see you guys later. I'm just here to get the freaking thing and then start killing people. Yeet! It's great. Oh my god, my teammate is actually... Never had run out of bullets with this, guys. Putting a sentry gun out here. Friendly shock RC is ready. UAV recon ready for deployment. Friendly shock RC has been destroyed. Friendly shock RC. Don't even need vulture here. Friendly shock RC is coming. UAV online. UAV recon is standing by. Repeat. UAV recon is standing by. UAV online. UAV online. Friendly shock RC is coming. Friendly shock RC is ready. Low. Friendly shock RC has been destroyed. Friendly Shock RC has been destroyed. Friendly Shock RC is coming. UAV online. Friendly Shock RC has been destroyed. Friendly Shock RC is ready. UAV recon ready for deployment. Friendly Shock RC is coming. Friendly Sentry gun deployed. UAV online. Friendly Shock RC has been destroyed. Oh, I got the nuke. Friendly Shock RC is ready. Okay, I think I can kill myself now. UAV recon. And try to get a second nuke. I like how it explodes the car, which is great. Now I just need my teammate to die, so I can get that that gold. Oh my god! I got killed. Oof. Contact with enemy. UAV 
I didn't reload, excuse me. I don't think I'll be able to get this second nuke, this half. I reload. I didn't reload. Four minute half. So you gotta, you gotta get a nuke. You gotta get a nuke in in two minutes. I just- I, I really need the UAV more than anything. Okay. Alright, so... I need to kill myself real quick. slow okay so it took me a minute and a half to get all those kills so we'll just get this point here when the guy gets the enemy's gold has been captured we have taken the enemy's gold wait where's the enemy it up chocolate peanut butter cookie I cream ice cream milkshake sunday that sounded really long but it sounds amazing xp wise we got a lot that makes sense 15,000, and we play the whole time limit. 